iDome Sky Spotter Arrow or Red Drone. The names may differ, but the goal is similar, protecting Israel's skies from incoming threats. And all were on display this week at the Israel Air and Missile Defense Conference. I believe Israel is uh, ready by having a multi-layer uh, defense, active defense uh, system from the very low altitude uh, systems and in the higher tier for the aero system. And all, all these things are tied with the drone down system. While security officials and industry leaders gathered to view the improvements and upgrades to existing systems, threats emanating from the region, namely Tehran, were at the forefront. We're starting to see accurate missiles in the other side, also the threat of drones and quadcopters. Uh, so the whole scope of, drone, of uh, threats uh, is, is here. If anyone around the world needed a wake-up call regarding Iran's ambitions or its capabilities, it came in mid-September with a successful and coordinated attack on Saudi oil fields, which have been attributed to Iran. The strike also revealed Saudi Arabia as unprepared for this kind of warfare. Local officials here believe a similar attack on Israel would end very differently. We are working hard 24-7 in order to have the capability and the ability uh, not to give the enemy the chance to saturate us or to cut us by surprise. An evolving battleground is not just an Israeli concern. Countries around the world are paying close attention to what is on display here. The situation in Europe also changed quite a bit uh, with the Russian uh, actions in Crimea and uh, in the eastern part of, of Europe. Maybe it's not that like in, in Israel, uh, but uh, the people are now getting aware that they have to do something about their defense. Israel is a global leader in the field of air defense, but that does not mean the work is over. The scope of threats and the progress on the other side mean the security establishment here has to constantly be looking for new solutions to new challenges. Jonathan Regev, I-24 News. Thank <laughs> you.